What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Red Thorns Gaming. I got a, a sort of a special treat here for you today. This is Fortress Siege number 21. 21? Do people actually still say that? I don't even know. What's so special about it is that this is not your typical Fortress Siege. It is for an A-grade fortress. However, it is not the same clans that we are used to seeing fight for A-grade clans. These are two totally independent clans from my understanding. They do not belong to any of the major alliances here on the Volokas N3 server. So let's go check out their combat power. All right, the first one is down here. Now these aren't the, the high-powered clans, all right? So don't be expecting a whole heck of a lot of a lot of gems and things like that being thrown out there. Combat power, holy moly. All right, here we go. There's the first one. Number 13, lucky number 13. Ashura, 97.8 million combat power in totality. The next one is down here at number 17 at 86.4 million combat power. Between the two clans, we are looking at about an 11.4 million combat power difference, but we all know CP doesn't mean anything. Let's see how much was paid. A Grave Fortress. Ashura, they are the defenders. Dark Legion paid 160 million one Adena for the right to challenge Ashura for this fortress. Let's head into the battlefield. All right, we have Ashura in the blue on the top. Dark Legion in the red on the bottom. Looking for Leaders, there's the leader right there, Cirque Cirque. Looks like a blade dancer of some sort. Interesting choice, and there are more of them. I noticed some names here. They must have gotten some help. All right, let's head on down to Dark Legion. And there is their leader, Vicron, Shillian Knight, or Shillian Templar, I believe is the name. Standard class, good for Fortress Siege. And getting some imprint time on the Holy Artifact, for sure. Looks like Dark Legion might be a little short. They paid a lot of money for them not to show up. But what I'm looking at here, I mean, I don't know, it's got to refresh and all that. But I'm definitely looking at more blue than red. Dark Legion are the attackers, so I will be following them. 60 seconds before we begin. 30 seconds before we begin. 10 seconds before we begin. Five seconds before we begin. And here we go. Fortress Siege, number 21, Ashura versus Dark Legion. And I don't see any, Red is trying to, to get their imprint. They were interrupted on one, they tried to go for Ashura's, they interrupted on Ashura's. Ashura's here in force now. I think Dark Legion is just, Missing a lot of people. And there goes the non-spawn gate of Dark Legion. This might be a quick battle, ladies and gentlemen. Ashura has gotten Dark Legion's altar imprint. They are now trying to get their own. Looks like they're going to do that. <laughs> and Ashura is already starting to imprint the Holy Artifact. They are seven seconds away from winning this battle. And they've been interrupted. But they are trying again. This is for an A-grade fortress. I don't know what's going on here. This might be the fastest, fastest fortress siege fight in the history of our server. Three seconds left. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, that took what, less than three minutes to do? Holy moly. Congratulations to Ashura. Absolutely stopping their way to Dark Legion to win this. I mean, Dark Legion, that's, that's it. That is it for Dark Legion. And that looks like to be it for Ashura. Not, <laughs> not a very, Exciting fight! I'm telling you, fastest Fortress Siege fight I've ever recorded. Congratulations to Ashura. Better luck next time, Dark Legion. You paid a lot of money f to really do nothing. Ugh. I don't know what to say about that. 
But hey, this will be a very easy video for me to to edit and throw up on YouTube. Congratulations to everybody who kept or won a fortress today. Ladies and gentlemen, hit subscribe if you haven't. It's free to do so. And come hang out with me on Facebook and Twitter. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you again.